So I'm playing with the ball here. And you'll see, just like that, and then we will pivot through the swing. How the right shoulder moves forward as we're doing this without the head moving forward. So let's do that, and then we'll go on to the kettlebell. So as we as we do this, we know the right shoulder is going to move on playing with the golf ball, but watch how the head moves and through eyes are through, but the head hasn't moved literally that way. We haven't rotated over with that. So let's let's try that one more time, John. So we know as we get to the top, this is on plane. That's good. But watch how this stays on plane and we move right through the golf ball. It's moving through it and going through the shot. There's three dimensions, but we're only going to deal with two. I'm going to hop in just for a second, John. You're dealing with the dimension of the right shoulder moving on plane with the golf ball through the shot like this. You're dealing with the dimension that the, the right shoulder is not tilting back like this and going through it. You're, you're wanting this right shoulder to be moving forward without the head moving forward, see? So you can do both. You can keep the head steady and then the right shoulder move forward and your eyes will pick up through the golf ball. 